Welcome back everyone to Vampire Expansion Episode 3. <laughs> that villager in the background, he has been cracking me up here lately. Look at him go. Anyway, right now I would like to run over to the stands down here, what's it called? The traders, and see how much I can afford right now. I would like to purchase some armor, maybe some weapons, but I don't know how much I can afford. <laughs> Hello there, what are y'all doing up here? Shouldn't y'all be down there in the dungeon? All right, let's trade with the crimson trader. To look at all this, totem of wolf and bat soul. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, look at all that. Should we get some of the weapons or armor first? Oh, that scared me. <laughs> that scared me so badly, oh my gosh. Dang, that really, really gave me a heart attack there for a second. Eat some pumpkin pie. Let's put in a whole dang stack. Let's start from the top and get a crimson helmet. Why not? We can afford a few more pieces. Let's get the chest plate. Let's get the pants. And let's get the boots. All right, we have a full set, y'all. We have a full set. Now we need to grind for some weapons. Oh my goodness. Crimson orb? What does that even do? The axe does 20 attack damage. Oh my gosh be locked and loaded with this stuff. Yo, we need to- what does this do? Crimson horse- ooh, zombie? Oh my gosh. Look at that zombie up there. And look at that zombie back there too coming to take me out. Alright y'all, what are we thinking? What should we spend our souls on? <laughs> that sounds bad. We need to go down here and grind some more though. We need- listen to that lightning. There's an enderman down here waiting to take me out. All y'all spawning in, a baby zombie right off the bat too. Goodness gracious. Please don't kill me. Look at that enderman right there. <laughs> y'all see him, ooh, y'all see him dancing? I need to be careful so he doesn't come kill me. I am waiting, y'all. I am waiting to put on all of this armor. I want to make the moment special, and I don't want to put it on just yet. I feel like I want to get a weapon first, and then really, really geek out all at once, you know? Maybe when we do put all of the armor on and equip ourselves with something powerful, we can go into hard mode. Look at this skeleton right here. Excuse me. And also, please comment down below any ideas if you would like to see me go do something in this series now that we are getting more locked and loaded. Um, really anything you would like, just comment down below. Skeleton, goodness me. Give me your souls, please. I'll put them to good use, I promise. Oh my gosh, y'all. That's not good. My shield just broke, I need to go make a new one. Do they have any kind of vampire shield up here? I probably won't even need one when I equip the armor, honestly. Oh! I just squatted, and then I realized once again that I don't have my shield. Why am I going so fast, by the way? I don't know, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> oh no, y'all, we need iron! Oh my gosh, we need iron for a shield, and I don't see any. That's not good. Okay, we need to gear up, I suppose, and go find iron somewhere. We have a new objective. I just forgot once again that there is an entire cave system under the castle. Why did I not go down there? I'm running out here looking for a cave to go in like an absolute genius. I don't know what's wrong with me. I found a cave, and I'm looking for iron. Hello there. Be careful down here. We don't know what kind of mobs we're up against, you know? We have to be careful. A creeper could just come out of nowhere and take us all out at any second with our armor on us. I'm not very smart. Like, I know that's clear already, but you know, the lights are on, but there's no one home right now. But yes, do comment down below any suggestions or video ideas that I can do in this series. I really love this expansion pack, and now that we have this armor that I'm waiting to try on, the opportunities are endless. I just don't know what I should do yet. I'm not too sure. Some lava down there. We'll probably run into the warden. Oh my god. <gasps> Ooh, diamonds! Beautiful. 
Y'all remember when I ran into the warden in my 1.19 series? Oh my gosh, that was terrifying. I'm getting nervous just thinking about it. I was just minding my business too and then all of a sudden I get the blindness effect. I got out of there so fast. Like if there was a time in Minecraft where I ran faster than the game will even allow you to run, it, w it was that day for sure. I never saw him though, I was really lucky. At least we found a diamond going down here so it wasn't a waste. We got iron and copper too, but the diamond really makes up for it, you know? Why I even came down here, I don't know. I'm really just geeking out right now. I knew I wanted iron and I kind of forgot about the basement to our castle. So I figured I might as well go find a little cave. There is a spider over there, a bat flying around some souls up there it looks like you know what i just realized they have a face on them <laughs> why did i just now realize this oh my gosh my pickaxe is about to break as well i need to make another one all right let's make a furnace i say as i make a crafting table now let's make a furnace smack it down right here smelt some of the iron we just mined so we can make another iron pickaxe all right, let's take our items and resources back up to the surface, go back to the, I guess, battle dungeon, and try to get some more souls so we can trade it with the crimson trader, get some more cool gear. Then we'll really be locked and loaded. Look at that water, oh my goodness, looking kind of crazy. Oh, is this a spawner room? It is! I didn't even notice this earlier. Hello, skeleton. Did he drop any souls? I don't know. I don't think so. Well, we have our own mom spawner back at the base, so we don't have to worry about that. Any other time I would be more ex- Ooh, creeper. I would be more excited. Just see me shift again, as if I have a shield. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get myself killed if I'm not careful. Now we can head back to the castle, get our ish together, hopefully grind for some more souls. Look at the sky right here. The Wandering Trader, there you are! Y'all remember in episode 2 I kept hearing him? I just couldn't find him anywhere? Well here you are, right outside the castle. Taking a little amble by the stream? Bless his heart. Look at him go over there with his llamas, oh my goodness. <laughs> There's the villagers still going to town. Let's put up our diamonds, um, copper, iron. Let's go to the mob chest here. Put up this random mob dropping stuff. Now I need to make a shield, just like so. I always feel better with a shield. Now I am going to equip myself with our full set of crimson armor. I am so excited right now. We gotta make this a big deal, y'all. We gotta make this a big deal. This is going to be absolutely majestic. Look at all this right here. Oh my gosh, I am going to be so locked and loaded. Okay, here we go. Look at us right now with our full set of crimson armor. Oh my gosh, look at those perks in the top right corner as well. I think I'm going to end this episode off here. I am super excited about the crimson armor. Thank you everyone for watching Vampire Expansion. I hope you enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed creating it. Feel free to comment down below your thoughts, your opinions on it. Also comment down below if there are any other mod packs or worlds on Marketplace you would like to see me try. Drop a like, subscribe if you enjoy the content, and I hope you have a great day.